like your style Put you in Chanel cause it's just perfect for your smile Girl I swear for you I'd run the world, I'd run the miles The way you look at me I think I'm going insane Everybody. What is going on? Welcome back to another reaction video. Today we're going to be reacting to the 29th best player in the NFL for 2019. Uh, he's a San Francisco 49ers player. We haven't seen many of them. His name is George Kittle. And uh, the only thing that comes to mind when I see that name is the fact that I used to work at a car dealership called Peter Kittle Motors. And, uh, you know, you don't really hear Kittle too much, so the only thing that comes to mind is my old job. And that was back in a previous lifetime. So with that being said, George, I think actually Peter Kittle, the boss's son's name's George, actually. That's why it comes to mind so much. His name's George Kittle. He's a tight end. He's probably going to be massive. Let's get into it. The quicker you here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing. There he is. I've seen him on the list. Oh, Georgie. Oh, Georgie. Look, I've actually wondered how tall he is, how big he is, because I've seen he's a tight end. Um, I'm thinking at least 6'5". Um, if my peers don't man, that's why I should make it. Diplomatic. Different attitude to most of these guys. I like it. He got one. <laughs> yeah, definitely like this guy. Gotcha. I gotcha. You see this on my arms? That's chicken skin, brother. I absolutely love George Kittle. Stone Cold Kittle NFL. Stone Cold Kittle. Touchdown catch. Oh, I love that. An NFL record. George Kittle most receiving yards by a tight end. Woo! George is, is killing it this No. Game. What a run! 1,300 yards! Oh! Go, son! Handed just brings it in, gets past two defenders, then puts in the other hand and puts the afterburners on. Holy fucking shit. Let's have a look at that. Oh! That's stunning. Bro. So he got 1,300 yards, I'm wondering how many touchdowns he got. Bang! That 37 should get him. He's fast, man. 
Oh, who's like that? Who's 37 for the... Who's 37 for the Chargers? I don't want to be talking shit about him. Is that... That's not... That's not Ingram, is it? Oh. So, LA Chargers, 2018, number 37. Oh my god, what the fuck? What the hell happened there? Where are you? There you are. Keeman Hall. Keeman Hall, cornerback. No. He doesn't have long hair. Ingram. He's 54. He's not going to be wearing 37. Alright. I don't know who it is. What I do want to see, actually, sorry guys, is Kittle's speed. I need to see his height. I need to see his... Uh, I need to see where he was drafted, how long has he been in the league. I need to see all this shit. 1993. He's just a baby. 25, 6 foot 4, 250 pounds. Holy shit, man. He went the 146th pick in the 2017 draft. He made the Pro Bowl last year. He had the single season receiving yards record for a tight end at 1,377. We're going to check that. That's got to be more than Tony Gonzalez now. Um, 131 receptions for 18, oh that's his career, okay, 4 years at Iowa, 22 games, 48 receptions for 737 yards, that's fuck all, um, what do we got here, he ran a 452 40 yard dash, 35 inches on the vertical, 11 foot broad jump, 18 reps on the bench, March 4th they signed him to a 4 year, 2.69 million dollar contract, which is not huge, but he went in the fourth round. Last year, 16 games, 16 started, 88 receptions for 1,377 yards, 15.6 yards per carry, the longest being an 85-yard touchdown. Five touchdowns, one rush for 10 yards. No fumbles. Most receiving yards in one half by a tight end, 210. Most receiving yards in a season by a tight end, 1,377. First ever tight end to lead the league in yards after catch, 870. Damn, man, this guy's a baller. Um, but look, it sounds like he's just coming into his own now, to be honest. He's finding a lot of space on that field. Um, what are we going to do here? NFL, what was that website? That's what it was. Love this website. Leaders. Receiving yards in a single season by a tight end. How do we do that? Holy shit, look at all these massive seasons. Wow. Wow. So Zach Ertz, tight end for the Eagles, had more receptions but not more yards. Um, if we go yards. George Kittle, eighth in the whole league. As a tight end, 1,377. Every single person above him was, was a receiver. And then we've got the second highest tight end. This is just last year. How do we go all time? No, this is fucking me off. I'm not going to be able to do it. Uh, okay, most, most receiving yards by tight end in history. In the national... This is going to be absolutely... Fuck, how am I going to do this? Receiving yards, year by year. The fuck is AV? Approximate value. Most receiving yards in a season by a tight end. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to put it into Google. We're going to fucking get this, guys. It's the last thing I do. So Rob Gronkowski <coughs> is second. Even if I just get first and second. But I wanted to see where Gonzalez was. I can probably just look up Gonzalez. So how many yards? 1,377 yards as a tight end. There he is. Okay, let's have a look. Let's have a look at his stats here. It's going to be interesting. Okay. The most he had, the most yards he had was in 2004. 
off 102 receptions, 1,258 yards. And I believe the list goes George Kittle, Travis Kelsey, then Rob Gronkowski. Okay, guys, that's it. Let's get back to George Kittle. Fucking hell. Wow. Alright guys, we're going to cut it off there, that was George Kittle, if you have enjoyed this video, hit the like button, if you want to subscribe, please do, if you want to tell me to stop trying to research shit all the time, please do that too, but by the time you tell me that, well I would have finished the series already, so look, we do what we can, guys, I want to wish you a fantastic day, we're here in Melbourne, I went to my first ever gridiron training, my second ever gridiron training yesterday, had a great time, feeling pumped about it. Season starts within three weeks. I'll see you there. Peace out. Everybody.